good morning welcome to our youtube channel if you're watching my video for the first time you're welcome and for my returning subscribers i say thank you may god continue to bless you please my new viewers i beg you to subscribe to the channel like the video share comment click on the notification button so youtube will always notify you when i upload new videos this morning i'll be teaching us how to prepare a cost breaker soup okay in case you're suffering from any kind of cause both family cause spiritual cause whatever cause you are facing maybe you are due for marriage yeah, no man have ever approached you or when it's time for your bride price to be paid the person will tell you stories okay or anytime you want to achieve any new thing something will just come and spoil it there are so many causes of that kind of problem it could be a family cause generational causes causes from maybe somebody you did business with or you offended okay so whatever the cause may be i don't want to start mentioning things that can lead to somebody laying costs on you some of the causes you encounter or the problem we encounter on daily basis are not our own doing some of them are being done by our forefathers and we keep suffering from it so i want to teach us how to use this soap to liberate ourselves permanently from that cause okay please let's get right into the video I'll be needing for this video is seven seed of alligator pepper. Please remember to open your alligator pepper, put in your hand uh, at your back. Okay, so you put just seven seed. This is the one I've opened already. I'll be using it for spiritual work. So you take seven seed of alligator pepper. Okay, this is seven seed of alligator pepper. You pound it. Okay. Another thing you eat is your soup, your native black soup. your ashes ashes the one you get from a uh, charcoal a uh, burnt firewood okay when you cook with firewood you add your ashes add your salt please this is a local salt add your salt that add your sand so little quantity is okay so you add another thing you add is ojuku palm oil okay remember what i told us about this ojuku palm oil Ojuku is, my, is my, a particular palm fruit, okay? It's very strong in anything that has to do with destruction or bad thing, and it's probably good for anything protection, okay? So since we are destroying the plants of the enemies or the cause led by the enemies, so we'll be needing this Ojuku palm oil to make the soap more effective. 
so you add a little quantity of it a separate mortar for anything you're doing any spiritual work you're doing okay don't use your normal cooking mortar for it this one this is my mortar i usually use it for all my spiritual work okay so even if you cannot get a big one like this get the smaller one so Can see how it is we are done with the mixture remember the first thing i added was my seven pieces of alligator pepper okay i added my native black soap i added ashes gotten from firewood okay i added my native salt or local local salt i added sand which represents it I added the uh, ojuku palm oil okay please don't use any other oil apart from this ojuku palm oil any other one you use will not make it effective so this is what we brought see how the mixture looks like okay see how it looks like you can see it is properly pounded see how it looks like okay so what you do get a brown pepper like this please do not use nylon or a container get a brown pepper like this cut it i'll be doing it now cut the pepper this way Only you will use it. Please, you get your native sponge. Use the soap only at night. Okay? Use only at night. And please, when you're using this soap, don't bear it with somebody. So that something that is the cause will not affect the next person. The person might be innocent of the cause. And remember, as you're using this, keep praying as you're taking your bath with it. Pray out whatever you feel that is the cause behind your problems. If it's late marriages, pray it out that God should give you a spouse. If it's generational causes, you pray it out that whatever you don't know does not know you. Just pray out whatever your intentions are. Okay? Please, you use this sponge once. You get seven. Okay, just get. If you can use the soap for seven days, fine. For 14 days, fine. So anytime you use it, make sure you throw this thing away immediately. In the night, use only at night. After you use batting, just go straight to the try. Don't throw it inside your house, please. Outside your house, please don't. Don't keep this uh, sponge. Let it not slip over in your house, please. Don't dispose it immediately after taking your bed. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you've not yet subscribed, and keep sharing the video. Thank you for watching. I have a blessed day.